Oh, it is dark down there. It is dark. Oh. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Are there... Whoa, whoa, what the heck was that? Oh my gosh. What the heck? <laughs> wow, I can't believe we're finally doing this. Hello, hello. Thank you so very much for checking out this video, for being here for the very first episode of my Subnautica playthrough. In case you couldn't tell, I am so, so excited to finally be playing this game. I've heard so many amazing things. I know so many people love this game, this series. I really hope that I do it justice. I know this is gonna be so much fun. This is a blind playthrough. I've never played Subnautica before. I haven't seen really anything about this game. I want this to be a pure playthrough. I wanna give you a, um, well now I'm spacing out on the word. I, I can't think of the word, right? I wanna give you a genuine, <laughs> there's the word I'm thinking about. I wanna give you a genuine reaction. I wanna give you a genuine pure playthrough. Hopefully I can capture that magic that I know so many people experienced while playing this game. And I'm just going to go ahead and say, as always, what I lack in skill, I make up for with heart. So please don't give up on me. Don't give up on me. All right, Subnautica, this is it. I'm really liking this music. Not what I would have expected, I guess. I mean, this is, this is nice. This is nice to vibe to. Are you ready for this? Let's count it down together. Our Subnautica journey, three, two. Okay. <laughs> okay, we've got, we got a couple of options here. We have survival, freedom, hardcore, and creative. Survival is the one that was recommended to me. Um, I think that's what we'll experience this game on. If you've played Subnautica, let me know what you started out on and which one is your favorite mode? Who knows, maybe if we love this game so much, we'll return to it and try hardcore sometime. I don't know. I usually love playing games on the hardest difficulty, but I don't really play this genre of games. I do play a lot of different kinds of games, but like survival games, I don't really, I haven't really played many. So this will be interesting to say the least. Survival, crash land on a dangerous alien planet scavenge resources and manage hunger slash thirst to survive all right we can do this we can do this right right please let's do this survival it is oh man this is crazy this we're actually playing subnautica we're actually doing it we're about to load into the game it's starting press any button to continue now for real this time three two i'm gonna press a for adventure three two one oh man we're definitely not skipping this guy's scene. come on now Gonna get hit by some of that debris as well. <laughs> that would be terrifying. Oh my, imagine getting just rocked by that thing. Oh my, we just got. I. <laughs> it just didn't look safe. It just didn't look safe. That was a perfect time for a nap, though. Oh my gosh. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Insert that meme. Oh. Okay, use feedback menu to report bugs. Okay. <laughs> well, there seems to be a fire in here. Does that count? So we can press A to pick up the fire extinguisher. Yeah, we're not going to die. We're not going to die, but I'm also looking at all the meters on the bottom left. Press... Dude, I'm pressing it. I'm pressing it. Press right trigger, dude. Literally doing that. Oh my gosh, bro. Now I just walked into the fire. I kid you not, I'm... I, that was left trigger, man. <laughs> Look, so you know I'm not crazy. This is right trigger. This is left. Unless I completely misread that. I don't know. I got to see the replay. Did it say right or left? <laughs> okay, let's actually just save our protagonist. Over here, taking in all the smoke. 
Okay, booting up emergency mode. Does anyone copy, please? We need help. Minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive okay. to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Good luck. Well, thank you, nice robot. I wonder if we should come up with a name for this robot. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm going to name the AI Sunny. I don't know if it actually has a name already, but I'm going to say Sunny. It's kind of like a mix of Sub and Nautica. So, I don't know. It's the best I got. <laughs> That's what we're going to go with. All right, now press this button to open up the PDA. Wow, actually, that one, at that time, I actually pressed the wrong button. Nice, we've got quick slots as well. Nice, okay, okay. Yo, the music was really sick though. Again, just not the kind of music I would expect, I guess. <laughs> but I'm really, really liking it. The graphics look really, really good. We are playing this, by the way, on PC. I am using a controller. I am using the, uh, the controller, in case you couldn't tell already. Let me know if you prefer playing with controller or with mouse and keyboard if you're playing on PC. Or just let me know if you played Subnautica, what system platform did you play it on? I'm usually really bad with mouse and keyboard. That's kind of why I, I tend to stick with uh, controller. <laughs> Alright, we have a damaged radio here. Use repair tool. Okay, okay, so just shooting the fire extinguisher at things is not going to cut it, huh? We can climb the ladder. Should we climb the ladder? Use fabricator. We've got no more fire in here. Oh, we've got an escape pod as well. Oh, let me try climbing out. Oh my goodness. Wow, man. There's so much to take in. I was looking right over here first thing. I was like, dude, I want to go stand on that. And then it was like, whoa, in the background, we have a giant ship. Orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Zero human life. I can't tell her. The subtitles playing for some reason. I mean, I have the subtitles turned on, but I wasn't seeing them on the screen there. Granted, I am taking a lot in. This looks awesome. This looks so sick. Hello! Can you hear me? Wow. Man, no signs of life. That's a giant ship, and we're the only survivors. We're the only survivor? That is crazy. Oh, this is so relaxing, though. Really love the sound of the, uh, of the water. The look of the clouds. It is... Honestly, you know, all things considered, we did just experience a nightmarish crash, but it happened on a beautiful day. Silver linings and whatnot. Am I right? We got to stay optimistic. I'm going to try to make the jump over there. All right, let's see what happens. I got my trusty uh, fire extinguisher here. Oh, oh snap. Wow. Wow. Dude, this looks beautiful. This looks incredible. Look at all the colors. Dude, we can pick this up? An acid mushroom? The heck is that thing? Let me grab this. Are these your mushrooms? <laughs> I just need a couple. I just need a couple. Oh, this is so amazing. This is so amazing. I do not even know. S swim to surface. Swim to surface. Oh, man. Oh, no, no, no. We're not dying. We're not dying. Okay, I want to get right here. I wonder if there's a day and night cycle. Are we standing on the thing? Oh man, D just stand up, stand up. <laughs> there we go, now we're standing a little bit. This current is strong. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, one of my biggest fears would be to just wake up and look in every direction and just see ocean, right? That would be so terrifying. I don't even know if I would ever even go scuba diving or anything. Would you go scuba diving? Have you been scuba diving? Definitely want to go scuba diving in a, in like in a, on an alien planet. <laughs> I'll tell you that. <laughs> Thank goodness we have the video game for that, huh? It looks amazing. It looks amazing. 
Wow. What is that? Looks kind of like a upside down lamp or something, like a desk lamp. I don't know. Just want to take a moment here and say, please, no spoilers, no back seating. Like right now, I have no clue what I'm supposed to do. I appreciate you so much and I thank you ahead of time for your patience. <laughs> Uh, we will get through this, don't give up on me. But yeah, please, I want to give you a pure playthrough. So, as tough as it is, please refrain from spoilers and uh, no backseating, please. This is all about having fun. It might take me a while, but I promise you, I promise you, we'll figure it out. Oh, sick, wait, wait. Oh man, I thought we launched out of the water. Let me try that again. It's because the way the waves are. Wow, it almost looked like we launched out of the water. That's so sick. Dude, this is amazing. I love this. <laughs> oh man, okay, we definitely... Oh, we have a bar for the fire extinguisher. I'm realizing, oh no, oh no. <laughs> I wonder if there's a day and night cycle in this game because we are probably wasting just daylight, right? Where's my oxygen level? We've got like no oxygen. Honestly though, no, 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 no deaths yet, no deaths yet. I can't hold my breath at all, so. There's the sun. Let's see if we can notice if it goes lower at all. Okay, okay, let me see. Well, what's my mission? What's my mission right now? What am I supposed to be doing? Okay. Suffered minor head trauma. What the heck am I supposed to be doing, man? Oh, oh, what did I do? Screenshot. Oh, I just took a bunch of screenshots. Escape pod. Oh, it is terrifying out there. Okay, solar power cell. We've got some of these. Uh, it looks like, okay, warning, warning. Okay, flotation device is deployed. Let's go ahead and, and take this. We have some first aid now. So that's good. Is this is like a charger for our fire extinguisher. This is our chair. Damaged radio. Use repair tool, but we don't have one. Okay. Okay, resources. Hmm. All right. Glass and stuff, pretty cool. Electronics, copper wire. So we can create, okay. Okay, so if we get a bunch of these mushrooms and by using the copper ore, we can actually create a battery? It's kind of crazy, right? This looks, yeah, we don't have any of that, but we do have <laughs> some of the mushrooms, so that's good. We need food. Filtered water, ingredients unknown. Wow, why does it say pin recipe? So equipment, this is what we need to create. Standard O2 tank, so we can finally breathe for longer than like two seconds. First aid. Hmm. Oh, cool, cool. So the fire extinguisher, we can create another one in case we run out. All right, that's pretty neat. Did I miss one? Bottom one, deployables. Sea glide. Oh, this is a lot. This is a lot to process. It's a lot to take in. Just went through a crazy crash. <laughs> oh, let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. I guess we're going to go back out there and just start. Oh, it's dark. It is dark. Well, that answers. Wow. So you can see that answers our question. If there's a day and night cycle, huh? Dude, this is awesome. Wow. Thankfully, none of these aliens want to hurt us. Oh, we got all the different lights. This is amazing. Glow in the dark. Hello. Are they friends? I'm gonna try. Let me try swimming up to one. Hello, hello. Oh, I, I picked one up. The heck was this thing called? A boomerang? Oh, well, we got rid of it. I'm sorry, man. What, what do I do with you? What do I do with you? I pressed B, and it looks like we saved him in our inventory. 
Uh, we need some more oxygen. oxygen. Swim, swim to the surface. Swim to the surface. Oh, it's dark. It's really dark. I'm going back under. Limestone. This was highlighted. I'm gonna grab that. That might be important. Oh, it is dark down there. It is dark. Oh. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Are there... Whoa, 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 what the heck was that? Oh my gosh. What the heck? <laughs> I, I, I... Get to the surface. Get to the surface. What the heck was that? <laughs> he just blew up. He blew up. I need to go explore. We have to explore. I guess that's going to kind of be the mission for today. Is just... Calorie intake recommended. Calorie intake recommended. We're hungry. Oh no. I don't know if we have a limit to... Dude, this keeps going. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, oh. oh darn it. Please, please. Oh, what the heck, man. Copper what the heck? What was that? Of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely, but plausible. Oh, we've got oxygen bubbles here. The heck was that? Dude, we are not ready for... I don't like this. It's crazy dark, man. Do I have a flashlight or something? I can't see. I can't see. Help me, boomerang. Help me. How do we... I mean, I imagine we have to eat the fish. Let me grab this one. This one's a little bit different. Oh, it's so fast. So fast. Okay, I'm gonna bring... Wow. Let me see if we can grab these things. I am sorry. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm just... I'm trying to survive. I don't even know where I am. I'm a long way from... Oh, oh. Swim to the surface. Swim to the surface. Swim to the surface. Oh, we've got the sunrise. Sunrise. Where? Wow. <laughs> Our first sunrise in Subnautica. Amazing. Yeah, you can say that again, buddy. Wow. Beautiful, beautiful. Well, we've only one evil fish. Those exploding ones, I don't like them. I see another fish right over here, I think. This one, like, really, I mean, it has an amazing sense of humor. Super funny. I'm, almost, I'm gonna release you. I'm gonna release you, man. Go on. Oh. Let me get him back out here. Be free! Be free, my friend! <laughs> Sent for help. You, on the other hand, you're coming. You're coming with me. Whoa! Darn it! Oh, this is terrible. I got him, I got him, I got him. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I need to survive. My, my character is crazy hungry right now. Okay, okay. Uh, what do I do with this? Oh, there's something here. It's a storage container. Okay, good. Okay, food, food. Okay, we're going, we've got... Does that say Gary Fish? I'm, I'm probably totally mispronouncing that. And then we've got the Boomerang. We'll go with the boomerang first. Thank you very much, man. Thank you. Now you're getting cooked as well. It is common for those accustomed to synthetic foods to be repulsed by eating an animal carcass. Remember that humans survived this way yeah. for millennia. You can too. <sighs> I hope so. <laughs> All this water is making me thirsty. Cheers, everybody. Thank you so much for being here. Well, now we have some food. Apparently, we can make some kind of... We can make a battery. What happened? Oh, no, no. We got to eat. We got to eat. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to make a battery as well. I don't know what we can use it for, but... Yo, what the heck was that? <laughs> this music, man. This music just comes in hot. <laughs> It comes in blasting. It's like a, like a trailer, like a movie trailer. Yo, what the heck was that? New blueprint 
Okay, how do I how do I eat some food? How do I eat some food? We can eat this. Consume. Vital signs stabilizing. Good, good. Good eating around the fins, apparently, for this boomerang. I'm gonna go ahead and eat that as well. Alright. Uh, can I put a battery here, maybe? This is solar powered. Damaged. Okay, we need to build maybe like a, uh, so I don't know, do we have like repair tools or something? Damaged radio, yeah, use a repair tool. We got some kind of, oh, this is great, a scanner. Nice, let's go ahead and build, let's build a scanner, let's do it. The scanner can be used to synthesize nice. blueprints from salvage technology and to accord alien biological data. Okay. So, self-scan? Self-scan complete. Vital signs normal. Okay. <laughs> Continuing to monitor. Oh man, this thing's crazy. Can I... It sounded like I could scan machines or something, but... Okay, it doesn't work like that. Alright. Alright, let's go back out there and loot a little bit. Yeah, we can't build anything else. Is there anything I would like to build? Uh... You know what I would really like is... Yeah, this. So we need three titanium. Okay, let's go look for some titanium. Let's go do it. That should be easy. Oh, thank goodness. It's still daytime. <laughs> All right. Three, two. Is there a jump button? All right, titanium. Where might we find? Oh, go ahead and scan this. Beautiful. Wow, okay, okay. Oxygen level? What was that? What the heck was that? This thing? Oh, whoa, whoa, dude, dude. Scan it, scan it. Alright, that's how many jump scares for this game already? Oxygen. Okay, okay, press this to view. I need to go to the surface real quick. We're gonna look at that, we're gonna look at that later. Swim to the surface, swim to the surface before our friend comes back. <laughs> Oh, is it already getting dark? No, no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. We're right there. We're right there. We're right there. Okay, this is gonna be a stressful game. Is that what you're telling me? Okay. Okay, so this isn't just going for like a swim in a pool, right? Cozy time. No, this is this is survival. This is scary alien fish that sneak up on you with their really, really loud noises. <laughs> this is you might drown if you stay underwater for too long. Oh, okay. Okay. So we've got the stalker, a streamlined predator encountered in the kelp forests in weight of prey, leaving the safety of the shallows to feed. The stalker likely carved out its evolutionary niche at the sweet spot between speed and size millions of years ago, and may be one of the oldest species on the planet. The stalker appears to be attracted to titanium. Okay, so it's a good thing we're reading this. <laughs> We're, we need to find titanium, so we have to go back over there to our friend. Okay. So which tends to sharpen and put stress on his teeth. That's pretty sick how they have all this world building stuff, right? As with many predators, it may be possible to temporarily distract hungry stalkers by feeding them. So if we maybe capture another fish, we can release it around the stalker. Hmm. So teeth, the stalker's teeth are unusually hard and fast growing. Its elongated snout can deliver huge biting pressure to larger attackers while also being used to reach small herbivores seeking refuge amongst the rocks. It has night vision. <laughs> Retinal layering on the eyeballs suggests adaptation for nighttime hunting. Dorsal ridges, the list goes on and on. These are just the, I don't know, the top of the food chain around these parts, right? These ridges can be moved independently to deliver superior maneuverability. Pelvic fins, long and powerful, the stalker has evolved to hunt the fastest of prey. Now I gotta say, I, the sloth is my spirit animal, so if it has evolved to hunt the fastest of prey, where does that put me, right? I am so slow, I'm gonna be a sitting duck, this is not good. <laughs> Assessment. Stalker teeth may have applications in enameled glass fabrication. Okay. That's a lot. That's really cool, though. And then we have some things about the coral. Yeah, passing a lot of nutrients. What happened? 
What happened? Seek fluid intake. Have we built any water yet? Come on. There we go. We got some water. We need bleach. We need bleach or something. Dude, are you kidding me? Where the heck are we going to find that? Okay, let me go back in here. We need water. We need water. We might be able to get water from eating the creatures. I feel like we did something like that. Okay, so we need to find... So, basic materials. Bleach, salt, and coral tube sample. Okay, let's go back out there and get some... Are we even making progress? What is that over there? Okay, okay. Oh, this is so much. There's so much here. I saw something. I saw something over here. I We probably need to focus on getting some water or else we're going to die. I'm going to go see what this... Oh, what? what is this? Well, we just found we just found something, so that's good. We just found another one. Oh, grab this guy! Grab this guy, dude! Oh, he got away from me. He's too fast. Let me go up here. This might be what we saw. Oh, oh, come on, come on! You're so close. Yeah, there's something here. No, it's just this rock or whatever. It's playing music like I did something. I don't know. Did I do something good? Did I do a good job? <laughs> oh, coral plate. How do we how do we break all this stuff? Hey, we got another metal thing. So that's good. All right. All right. How about this. Can we grab this? It's just a creature egg. Advanced theories. Got this? Oxygen is getting pretty low. We got plenty of these. I, I'm gonna capture some, um, some fish. I feel like if we eat the fish, that gives us oxygen. Get over here! Get over here! About this one. Alien <laughs> life forms may have unexpected applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven Whoa. survival strategy. We're just going to ignore that in the background. Okay, so utilizing that, and I meant to say we can, oh, here we go, got another one. We can use the fish, if we eat them, maybe we'll get, so, oh no, not that one. We might be, what the heck was that? What the heck was that? Oh, 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 is that the same thing? It has, it has, what are those, are those, is that its head, or does it have a piece or something? It's got like pieces of my ship. Well, thank you. It brought it right over to me. Oh, I got to get up. I got to get up. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. <laughs> wow. Oh, I can't see anything. They're, they're... Where am I? Dude, where's the Calorie ship? Intake recommended. Calorie intake recommended. There's so much happening. There's so much happening. Everyone remain calm. I'm not trying to bother you. I'm not trying to bother you. I'm just trying to survive. That's it. It's simple as that. I, I'm going to... I need to grab like another fish so we can cook them or something. They're just way too fast. Darn it, dude. Come on. We got it, we got it, we got it. Okay. Let's go back. Let's go back home. Oh. All right. All right. Let's go ahead and cook this up. <laughs> Where's the thing? So can we finally make water? Oh, this is great. Okay, so if we get the bladder fish, apparently we can make water. So that's good. Because, yeah, we desperately, desperately need some water. And let's go ahead and just cook something, because we're getting hungry. The cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Hmm. Oh, we just created titanium. We just, we're creating titanium and we can use this. We can use this for something. There's so much. Okay, okay, before we use the fabricator again, let's go ahead and feed. I am starving. Vital go. signs stabilizing. Drink some water. Vital Eat that up. Stabilizing. Delicious, delicious. Okay. Now, uh, what did we want for it? Yeah, standard O2 tank. We can get so many things. We can get a pipe. We can do a floating air pump. That's pretty cool. 
I imagine then, okay, so maybe this will let us breathe underwater longer if we place them around uh, strategically. The fins will be pretty sick. Okay, I'm building. I'm building a standard O2 tank. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go! We are out here surviving! <laughs> Did we just get more stuff? High capacity. Uh, this game is introducing us little by little. Waterproof lockers. Small storage. That's pretty sick. We can build another scanner, but we don't want to. Okay. Um, floating air pump. I'm gonna save that stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna save this. We just we just got a lot of stuff. Oh, this has just been something else. This has been something else. <laughs> There's so much freedom. I'm not really used to playing games where you can kind of just go and do whatever and explore. But this is cool. This like sense of discovery has been really sick. Oh, let me go ahead and get this guy. Oh, we can't grab him. We can't grab him. What the heck? This looks like a... Uh, well, let's go ahead and scan it, at least. Oh, wrong thing. <laughs> There's the scanner. It's a shuttle bug. Hold still. We got him. We got him. I want to be able to read these. Let's go ahead and read this real quick. The uh, day two. Day two, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, uh, ba ba ba. Is it one of these? The shuttle bug. So it's a common scavenger. So the mouth parts are small enough. Yeah, to be of little threat, okay, to most organisms. This creature is clearly adapted to feed on the waste products, okay, of the ecosystem around it. Its presence may indicate nearby cave systems. That's interesting. Dang, it's still on fire over there. What did it say we needed? Seek water or something? Okay. Sorry. I want to see... If I can activate a light or something, I, I need to see if... Wow, this thing's so cool looking. Let me scan you! For science! <laughs> I love this. Wow, rabbit ray. This is amazing. If I'm really, really loving a game, I tend to just explore everywhere, and I try not to leave any stones unturned, so bear with me as I scan every single creature and stuff in this game. I think it's so cool. <laughs> the closest thing I've played to this was uh, Abzu, which was very, very different. Very different. I don't know why I went all the way over here to read about the rabbit ray. I like the acoustics in here, though. I think that's what it is. So, herbivorous aquatic life form rabbit ray appear to live serene and solitary lives with few predators a natural sense of curiosity and awesomely poisonous flesh oh dang oh dang we're not we're not gonna be going for that one then overall it's inedible but harmless so that's good i like that i like that thank you very much rabbit ray rabbit ray wins fatality super sick we need that one fish. And <laughs> we need the fish that will give us the uh, the water. I think it's this guy right here, actually. It's the bladder fish. Yeah, that bladder fish is the MVP for sure. I don't know why I keep taking screenshots. My bad. If we can grab some kind of fish to eat, because our character is getting hungry, man. I'm starving! Grabbed another bladder fish. We, we could probably should get a couple of those. How are we looking on oxygen? Oh, we have increased oxygen now. Let's go. We have way too many mushrooms as is. Yeah, this music is awesome. Sorry, buddy. Coming here for all of these. <laughs> I'll go ahead and scan it. Yeah, seek fluid intake. What is going on over here with this guy, though? Can we grab him? Ooh, ooh. He just flew away? Okay, okay. Okay, there are a million things happening. There are a million things happening. We need water. 
We've got a, a couple of those bladder fish though, so that's good. This is sick. I'm gonna I'm gonna enter through underwater. Let's go. Build up some water. Nice. You have to build it every time? Okay, okay. Definitely build a couple. Good job, bladderfish. Good job. <laughs> you are keeping us alive. <laughs> okay. Um, so now we go here, I think. Vital signs. Go ahead and consume that. Beautiful. 87. What about this egg? What's the deal with that? Let me see if we can create some kind of light because it is so dark. Tools. A flashlight! We need glass. We need glass. Okay. That's what I want. I want a flashlight so I can finally see. Can we f create glass? We can. We need quartz. I want to say we picked up quartz once before. Let's go back out there. This is it. Day three, I think. <laughs> oh, man. This has been so amazing. This has been so amazing. See, they're flying all over the place. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's wow. drive core may result in a quantum detonation. What the heck? To monitor. This isn't good. All right. I think this will be a perfect time to pause the game, to pause our playthrough. We are officially on day... Let me double check that real quick. Day three. So we we survived the first two days. We haven't died at all yet, which is good. We've been learning the ropes, right? We figured out how to consume fish, how to get some water. We created an oxygen tank to allow us to breathe longer, which is so great that we've been making some really cool progress. A bit of a rough start with that crash landing, but we're making the most of it. We're out on this alien planet trying to survive, but nothing will rob us of our smile until you get attacked by those evil fish. Then it, you know, then it's no more fun, right? Then it's like, just get me the heck out of here. Oh, I can't wait. I think the thing I'm most excited for is just this sense of mystery. There have already been so many surprises with the different sea life and how some of them will just swim right up to you, some of them blow up, some of them will attack you, some are harmless. It is so cool. I would love for you to continue to join me on this adventure. Like, subscribe if you're new, comment, let me know how I did for my first try. Please be nice, please be nice. Again, when I lack in skill, I make up for the heart and I promise you will only get better. I'm already very much looking forward to recording another episode. I thought this was just awesome. I thought it was so much fun. But yes, that will do it for this one. Stay safe, stay awesome. I hope to see you soon, and thank you so very much for watching. Later, later. I'm just a